Hello and welcome back for another casting and this time we have Skelly against Mr. Boat. We have Skelly as set against Mr. Boat as Odin you can see. It's gonna be I think quite hard for Mr. Boat here on this map because set aggression might be quite strong on Tundra but you can see Skadi is not advancing quite early actually so it, it won't be like 4 minute 10 shifty sense abused here and we got 655 from Mr. Boat it does decide to <laughs> to go on the wood right now case of shitting sense on his hunt here uh, yeah. Yeah, yeah, we can see some rocks on the way here I guess Skadi is just here to do a shifting sense it's not the best because it only takes two airs here and they will literally survive we have fire um, forest fire but yeah it's actually not that good either I guess it's better to, to just keep it for later on oh, and actually the is gonna die now and Skadi is going for really aggressive classic fight here it's really aggressive The advantage is Skadi is still hunting while you can see Mr. Boat is on his ghost even though he could probably hunt Zeus. Not sure Skadi knows. Oh yeah, he knows actually, my bad. <coughs> uh, since it's set, actually set as all the maps quite fast and is even still con um, converting some animals here. We got a tower upgrade here for Mr. Boat, but is gonna get destroyed so it means this um, long house is gonna get destroyed too and Skadi is trying to micro his slingers on the Treyarch's man so yeah we have we have pickaxe here we have also blue crystal shard which might help Skadi economy nicely and we have pickaxe and head axe for Mr. Boat but yeah you can see Skadi is spamming quite a lot of army he also has the animals which take some pressure too so yeah I guess Skadi is just gonna just try to uh, zone around Mr. Boat base He is on his way on the top here, probably to destroy the wall in case Mr. Boat moves here. And yeah, Mr. Boat will probably take the opportunity to hunt a bit more while Skadi is busy on this wall. And yeah, you can see Skadi is really going for hard, he's going for Zeus Orox and probably on this one. But yeah, Skadi still making a lot of army and see population difference being quite huge. We have Osmondry on the way for Mr. Boat. He has plenty of boats too. So he still has a nice amount of food in base. And yes, yeah, Skadi did force pretty much this wall, I guess. Because Mr. Boat didn't feel confident. There is one animals on those aurochs and gold so Scandi will know when uh, Mr. Bode will be hunting or on the gold mine here we got medium slinger but I guess Scandi is now gonna aim for Eric yeah we got Amori here he did stop all his production army <coughs> even adding third barrack and now we got actually medium spearman. Yeah, he probably 
realize that he has to fight this. But I think Skadi is still winning this fight. <coughs> and yeah, Mr. Boat is hunting back now. And Skadi also. And Mr. Bot is taking that TC. It doesn't secure much, but I'm, I mean, it does actually. There is gold in the back and some food. So, yeah. And yeah, it seems like Skadi will be in time for that TC. Nope, he won't. He won't. He won't be in time. He won't even notice. Mr. Boat is taking the TC and Mr. Boat is having a lot of power of here. But at least he, he doesn't have the gold, so yeah, it's gonna be worse to get all those dwarfs. But Skadi is on his way to Neftis, here we go. And I guess it's gonna be a really, really strong push for population, probably maybe 2 TC. Yeah, you can see those villagers are probably on, on the way for this TC. And Mr. Bot is not really close to, to get uh, a rig here, so he, he will have to defend without frost uh, Scaly Push here. Here we go. Here we go. <coughs> the best for Mr. Bolt and yeah it's gonna be a, a fight here and you can see Neftis is on the way so Skadi knows he can move and in case he has uh, he has Ancestor and you can see this, this forest fire could have been great here and yeah Trax man are dying to this Wadjet and Slingers, you can see some villager got picked off and also Ox card. And uh, yes, I think. Uh, no, never mind, there's no, no more army from Skadi, so I guess he's gonna keep the Pope to make siege since he made one of the siege works. There's plenty of food and gold, um, wood and gold, so. He might maybe just make some Migdol units and uh, and some siege. Uh, that's weird. He's not even trying to make Migdol here. We have ancestor on the army and economy here, but I don't I don't feel like it's gonna be a really good fight for Skadi here. He might win it, but I think he he really took way too much time to decide when to fight. And yeah, there is plenty of earth here right on the ancestor, so yeah. <coughs> It still seems even. We got finally strong gold. Big doll here. But yeah, as you can see, it wasn't really good fight for Skadi. Did waste his god power here. But Mr. Boat is about to up Eric soon. He's gonna up Eric really soon. Here we go. We got Scaddy. Still have some spearman here. And yes, Scaddy doesn't have the wood. <coughs> doesn't have end axe. 
it's quite unlucky. And another middle from Scali. The thing is, Mr. Bot is gonna have a lot of gold and favor to make Frost Giant, but he has to defend against this uh, Sichuan first. Which might not be easy, because the Frost won't be in time. <coughs> Maybe it will actually. No, I guess it won't be in time because Mr. Bot is attacking. Different siege tower. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if he would have focused all his army at least on one siege tower, the first would have saved the CC. <coughs> but not here. At least Mr. Bot is gonna have a lot of army. I mean, a lot of frost giant at least. He does have a really nice amount of resources, but he doesn't have the army to spam the. At this point, it will help him quite a lot because the scale will do really great here. Because, as you can see, his caddy economy isn't that great and he's having a lot of uh, a slinger and chariot archer. And yes, caddy is going for the gold or the hunt. Yeah, actually, it's gonna be the gold. Oh, we got a market, so it's gonna be like. Small Ragnarok on the way, probably, or maybe it's here, who knows. But yeah, what I don't like here is Mr. Boat is sitting just on non upgraded units. So he has like. It's gonna be hard, uh, like non upgraded uh, ready cavalry against. Uh, there we go, you can see. And we got Bard. Yeah. I'm pretty sure uh, Mr. Boat could have. Maybe do a bit better with uh, staying a bit longer on Eric. <coughs> but yeah, we got oh, we got flow and Dax, heavy chariots, funeral rides, shadow on the way, force caddy, upper shield, and the rhyme upgrades for Mr. Boat. And <coughs> so far, Skadi doesn't expect Ragnarok because uh, he's still making Spearman. Okay, we see some barracks now. Maybe he did change his mind. But yeah, now Skadi literally saw the markets, which means there is possible Ragnarok on the way. We've got medium Axeman, so yeah, Skadi is preparing. That's why sometimes it's better to just hide the market, but I guess if Skadi saw that, he can expect Ragnarok for sure. But yeah, Mr. Bull should get more <coughs> armory upgrades that only right now he's doing it. He's gonna have only copper. Weapons and copper shield for his Ragnarok. Uh, yeah, I think Skadi is literally ready for that Ragnarok. He's getting some Axemen on the way. He has 3 TC, he has al he's almost full villager. So, yeah, he might lose his TC, but I'm pretty sure he will survive again on this one. He's fortified Town Center on the way, so maybe his TC. It'll be quite hard for Mr. Boat to destroy it. <coughs> and yeah, Mr. Boat has only 200 population right now. And since Kadi Mikring is priest to kill at least one first giant. Yeah, okay, 
meteor shards are dying here, but you can see that right now he's just dying also because there is chariots and Axeman here. But Phaeton Center wasn't enough for that to see. Wow. <laughs> That's really risky business here. Some greedy priest here, right in the middle of the fight. Yeah, so we're just gonna check the gold mines here. But you can see, Scaly Army is. Already enough to deal with, uh, with the Ragnarok. You can see Mr. Bot is on his way soon to get to rebuild the uh, villager, and he didn't eat Skadi enough with Ragnarok. Yeah, this is gold mine, this is gold mine also. Yeah, well, it's a bit greedy here. <laughs> Even more since there is some priest here, and yeah. Mr. Bot did realize he didn't do any damage, I mean, Enos damage with Ragnarok, so yeah, was pretty much over here. And this time we have Zeus against Ra, Skadi as Zeus, Mr. Bot as Ra, and it's on Alfame. Uh, let's see, it seems like there is some and yeah, not that. I mean, it's okay, and you can see there is probably like yeah, okay, there's not really starting and for boss player, but they both have quite a nice amount of and so I guess it's gonna be quite fine for Skadi here to deal against Ra, Ra, which might just go to TC or maybe actually no, this TC doesn't. Secure that much gold, maybe this one, but it's kind of greedy if Skelly goes for Athena here. It's kind of greedy, I guess we got. Oh no, he went for hunting dogs, okay. Pretty weird. Pretty weird. Since he stayed quite long on this hunt and didn't. Uh, on these chickens and he didn't go even on these elks. But yeah, why not? You can see Skadi is going for some chickens also. He knows about those Orocs, he knows about this one. I maybe expect Skadi going for Athena here, it's Kida's kind of gameplay. Yeah, we've got Athena. Got Athena got uh, got eight six five so yeah I think it's gonna be a rush yeah is it going add axe and pickaxe I don't know let's see no it's gonna be it's gonna be TC grab here it's gonna be a TC grab but it just made Jason and the Minotaur standing on the on the hunt here. We got Ta for Mr. Boat. I guess it's just gonna be one to see rain for Mr. Boat. Got the Minotaur right on. Oh, pro 
provide a small trickle of gold, which is really good. I guess you should have dropped it at start. <coughs> and as you can see, Scaddy is microing to kill Pharaoh. And that would be quite nice for Scaddy to steal this relic. But no, it's it, it did fail. What's about the other relic here? We got uh, more resistant building, more resistant to siege weapons. Can be good for Zeus since uh, he might deal against uh, siege tour soon. Walls are stronger and more hit points for building, so yeah. <laughs> Pretty much nice relic for building here in this game. <coughs> At end of the Pharaoh for. okay. Got Pesmondry and. Pickaxe and actually, oh damn, Mr. Boat is making barracks because he probably expect uh, Skadi to rush, I guess, because you don't really make two barracks just in case. So, yeah, it's pretty good. It's uh, 150 gold wasted pretty much here for Mr. Boat. So, yeah, pretty nice play from Skadi. And maybe misreaction from Mr. Boat here. We got Shadow on the way, he's gonna be one to see farms. And we got Sneaky Villager here, which uh, probably wall. Yeah. We have some walls on the way for Skadi to be sure about. <coughs> about uh, Mr. Boat not grabbing this TC. But I guess he could later on with. Uh, with. Uh, with the rock and you can see Mr. Bot is going a bit aggressive here yeah I guess I guess it's not that wasted then because he just made some army pr to probably grab this TC and uh, Skadi is finally making army but he won't be in time to contest that and he doesn't have the army either got the blow on the way so yeah, Mr. Bot did okay, I guess, here with his uh, barrack units. Uh, is that open here? I don't know. I don't know. And no, actually, Skadi did cancel late uh, and Dax. I think he did the boss upgrade, but he probably cancelled since he may is making and Dax right now. So yes, Kadi is going 3 TC now. Not making any army so far. So yeah, we will have a really big rain for Mr. Boat here. Uh, can't see the number of rain here. A farm seven. 11 and 8, so 19 farms. 18 since this one is not made yet, yeah, okay, it's under his way. So, yeah, 19 farms, so the, farm, the food income is gonna be quite nice for Eric here. He might jump straight, Eric, at, at the end of the, of the rain. Even two more farms, okay. He has to, he has to go to go on the gun right now or the wood. He has a bit too much farms, okay. He's going to shaft mine and at all. So yeah, you can see he's having a nice economy. Maybe he's gonna get right after a straight mythic right after. Okay, he's gonna like, he's gonna like of gold here. And Skadi will know about this and did drop blanket of Empress Zoe. And now we have double archery range and one military academy. The fuck? He doesn't even bother making a. Okay. That's a shit in sense used on two villagers pretty much, but at least. 
did uh, deny this hunt for and actually it's six orcs. So yeah, it could have been really 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 nice food income for our Scaddy here. Oh, and even so some mercenaries we should send what the fuck. It's not even needed. But yeah anyway, we see a nice army right on the gold mine. The Smigdal won't happen. It won't happen because there is way too much army, the Pharaoh might get sniped. No, never mind. Skadi did. Skadi could have probably sniped the Pharaoh here. We got a Locust used on few villagers, it at least killed two farms, probably a third one. Yeah. Maybe some more here. Got the bolt on the petit sucos, but the last farm didn't get destroyed. And here we go. So yeah, Skadi lost one villager and four farms on that locus. It's not really the best, and you can see that Mr. Boat is having way, way too much food. He just overcommit on the farms. Like I said, he was just making way too much farms, and he should have gone on wood and on gold. So yeah, now he's gonna have to sell his food for some gold. And yes, Skadi might just gold starve him. Okay, we got Skadi knows about that gold mine now since he lost his catascopos here. So he's gonna go around. Skadi is making stable too. He did stop his army probably on the way for. Uh, for Eric soon, as soon as he kill his last cause. And yes, some chariot archer from Mr. Boat here. That's fine, you can't hear my cat now. <coughs> so, yes, Kadi is gonna go, go for Apollo. Yeah, here we go. Apollo on the way, which might be quite hard for Mr. Ball to deal with the uh, underworld. But yes, Kadi also went for the second TC of Mr. Boat here. And you can see Mr. Boat is still hunting. I don't even know why. He has so much. Food. He should literally get the gold here. But yeah, he's preparing second Migdol because there is this army with restoration, which might be a big threat. But yeah, so far it's not really. Or maybe it's just also to produce more army. But yeah, it's about really need siege to push. And Skadi is really fine. He's almost full villager, missing just one. Villager, and he's gonna probably get uh, a phase two or even era right after jumping Eric. Guess we will see around the market. Got some stable here. Uh, no, no market so far. Is here we got the market. Mr. Boat still struggling with the gold, and uh, he has 2k gold, 2k uh, food. Okay, now he's having a nice amount of gold. Now it's gonna be Osiris on the way, probably. He's making siege works because he knows that Skadi store is DC uh, Osiris on the way and irrigation for Skadi but also era or oh, Hephaestus right after Hephaestus <laughs> actually uh, yeah, Skadi economy is gonna be quite good with full villager and the plenty 
Eventum is the boat is almost full years old too now. So now it's gonna be about Mr. Boat if he's gonna make enough damage with his uh, Osiris. He has to heal his Pharaoh. Yeah, he's preparing a priest here. We got heavy cavalry, uh, heavy camelry, heavy chariots also on the way, copper weapon, medium infantry, force caddy, fortress, which gonna probably make a police, shot mine also. <coughs> and yeah, this sneaky Pegasus is gonna probably just make a uh, world passage, maybe for the main base of Mr. Boat since. All his army pollution is way too far <coughs> of his main base. Got both also. Bones caddy. And yeah, Mr. Bot Gold isn't the great, isn't the best. Still not didn't even come back on this gold too. <laughs> and Fort Phaeton Santa Force Caddy Copper Mail for Mr. Boat, so yeah, he's having really decent army now. Plus the son of Osiris on the way, which uh, is here in the base. We got the plenty use forge of straight forge of Olympus. Okay, I did not receive that much army. Yeah, this figure is just gonna come really soon. Food control for Mr. Boat. Okay, Mason, Fort Fighter Center, it's gonna be quite uh, quite really strong building for Skadi. We've got Colossus on the way to destroy this. Uh, this Migdol, the mummy is. Or at least, oh no, yes, the mummy is here. The mummy, son of Osiris, is on the main fight here. Any police on the way? Quite a big army here for Skadi, and yeah, Son of Osiris did take a lot of damage. Skadi is fast blocking the unit, and yeah, Son of Osiris might take so much damage here just for one bad placement. Get control weapons for Skadi, and even more Migdol here from uh, from Mr. Boat. Mummy has been sent to deal with Colossus. Got some bear phone here, probably to take down that catapult. And you can see Scott is not even making more. Okay, we can have copper mail, so we can have soon or his copper upgrades. It's a bit the same here, we got the copper. Wait for Mr. Boat. We got restoration, and yeah, it's starting to be quite huge here. Three the police. Okay, you can see catapult got destroyed by Bellerophon. Bronze weapons, even archer, bronze weapons also for Mr. Boat with penetration. Which is okay, even though it's not gonna be uh, Skadi using a lot of cavalry here. It's making some, but not that much. And yeah, Mr. Boat really need to make market because once he's out of this gold, he won't get any 
Oh god. For Scanny, which has a nice amount of caravans, already 13. And yeah, we can see if Sabot is forcing to use Villager because he has no arc damage except some cavalry. get really nice armory raids his push is gonna be un unstoppable for Ra here even if Ra can get uh, some decent amount of max it's not gonna be enough to stop weak army with full uh, upgrades and even more in police got a rock in case to save some of the series here Police going on the way for the Smith doll, but it's not gonna matter because uh, Mr. Bot is still pushing a lot of army on the Smith doll. Skin on the Reno, we got Ambassador. <laughs> is Ambassador the right one? No, Ambassador is just useless, bro. <laughs> Ambassador is literally the upgrade you shouldn't make in 1vs1 uh, because it's a tribute thing and it's only when you give resources to your ally. So, yeah, Ambassador is useless, the other one, which is a tax collector, which is good because you reduce the, pr the price of, uh, of the market when you buy or sell resources. I'm trying to make some some towers to defend here. And one April is gonna try to kill some of the series with Slippicon and nope, not yet. But yes, all this area has been cleaned pretty much for Skadi and means also Mr. Bot won't have any market. We've got Champions Camelry here. Champion chariot, arch, uh, champions chariots on the way. Also, one tower, heavy cavalry actually, iron shield. So yeah, it's like it's gonna, it's gonna make some more, some more cavalry. So it's I guess the the creation is gonna be quite worse for Mister Boat. Even though his uh, towers might get destroyed quite fast with some police. Yeah, Mr. Boots will be out of gold. He will probably just resign when this gold will end because he doesn't have any market at all. Since he's losing his few catapults he made here. And yeah, Skadi is being pretty smart, just keeping uh from close to CC for the next catapult. You can see the three police are just cleaning. All Mr. Boat base. Mr. Boat has still nice economy, but God is almost over. He didn't manage to push quite hard. He's right on the fight with his Villager. Uh, it seems like the Son of Osiris did die in the end. Didn't pay attention, but yeah. Probably got sniped by uh, one gun or just few toxic here. And yeah, Petrobolus on the way also now. Smigdol will fall. Scanny also making towers to push. And we got some AD police probably from here. Just doing going their way to I don't know where, but just Dying to villager. Uh, yeah, 
Yes, yeah, Scuddy has almost all his upgrade is missing. He's missing iron mail. He's just probably stopping his attack. Probably not at the best time because literally uh, East about is out of gold. But there is maybe yeah, there is an underworld actually. There is an underworld. Uh, actually, Skadi didn't know, but if he would have keep pushing Mr. Boat, he would have won anyway because Mr. Boat would have reached this gold mine. So, actually, the underworld is pretty good for Skadi too, but it's pretty good for Mr. Boat because he just let Mr. Boat get some more gold. And you can see some watchtower which is gonna defend the Petrobolos here. I don't think this CC will fall because there is way too much villager preparing and the pharaoh offering that. And yeah, this guy is killing the pharaoh now, so it's gonna be quite helpful to take down this TC. And some random petroglyphs attacking the siege walls here. So about not even trying to make a market somewhere. Oh, we got guard towers now. Guard towers. And yeah, this kind of of lane with towers is just gonna be way too hard for Mr. Boat to deal with just because just because he has Way too much chariots right now, and chariots won't do anything against that. Yes, he will fall probably. Yeah, he will. Even though Skadi doesn't have a s engineer, he still has a decent DPS for this TC for this catapult. I mean. And yeah, it's, Mr. Bot was also losing his villager here. So yeah, no market. That's pretty weird for Mura here. I guess he was just expecting to to win Skadi army straight and just keep mining gold. But yeah, pretty nice gameplay from Skadi. So yeah, I hope you enjoyed this series, guys, and I see you next time.